What is up everybody? Sveinson here back with another MLB 9 innings video. It's SIG Pack Day, so we're going to go ahead and get that open. I'm super hyped, just like last time I'm going batter. Trying to land a Pujols, a Langford, a DeYoung, something like that to boost my team. Um, Colton Wong would be fine. Just hopefully not a dupe. Uh, so yeah, we're going to be going batter. The packs also came with some black diamond pieces. So uh, let's see how many we have. 148, so we'll get close to our next black diamond. We have the GI. We have skill change tickets. So yeah, we're just going to try to max out this card as much as possible. Um, also, earlier this week... I uh, realized it was double mileage weekend, so I made a SIG combo, or not a SIG combo, a, a vintage combo. Um, so I'm going to cut to that footage now, uh, so you can kind of see what I got there, and then we'll get back to this part of the video. So I just realized double mileage is ending soon, and I have a uh, diamond combo that I can do. Uh, so I'm just going to go ahead and do it. We're going to see what we get. Hopefully an Al Hobroski would be great. Or, in the back of my mind, you know, a legend would be nice. So let's go ahead and combine it. One, two, three, 700 stars. Let's see what we get. Ah, Tim McCarver. We take those. That's good. That's good. That's good. Hey. Well, I'm going to hopefully... Um, yeah, no, that's awesome. Still not the one Cardinal Vintage I really need. But he'll make my starting lineup for sure. Great. So yeah, that'll be it. Back to our regular video now. Let's get this SIG pack opened. First, National League Cardinals. Batter for sure. See what we get. Low speed field, high power. Uh, this is looking like it might be a Matt Carpenter, which would bum me out. But maybe it's a Paul DeYoung? The eye is too high. It's definitely a Matt Carpenter. No, it's Ozuna 19! Oh, that's so good. Okay, that's one of the ones I needed. That is one of the ones I needed. Okay. Whew. I was getting worried. Oh, that's going to be so good. That's going to be so good. That is one of the better Cardinals outfielders. Perfect. That's perfect, perfect, perfect. All right, so I'm going to work on getting him trained and uh, GI'd, and then we'll do skills. So I will be right back. All right, Marcel has been trained and taken to gold. Uh, let's go show you this training before I upgrade him. For general rule, I try to stick to 12 speed and field or less. Uh, I'm going to finish him off with amp tickets. So I have 13 con. 11 POW, 12 I. I think I'm going to finish it off with two more I, and the rest, seven to POW, I think is the best way to go about doing that. Um, unless he ends up with barrel it up, in which case we'll have to do something else. But total, he has uh, 10 fielding and two speed. I typically like speed more than fielding, but uh, both of them are very low, so I'm not complaining. Let's go ahead and take him to Diamond. Let's see. We'll sort by team. There he is, Marcelo Zuna, 2019. And boom. Oh, that looks so good. We will have to uh, change that GI around. I don't think I have a GI reset, and I also don't think I have the club coins. Uh, to buy one. 
Yeah, I only have 400. That's fine. Let's see what skills he landed. Training junkie? Yeah, okay. Let's go to skill changes. He needs them. Twenty-eight of these to try to land something good. Uh, I feel pretty confident about that, but let's see. Oh, he's in my player reserve, isn't he? Let's see. All right. Heavy hitter charisma. Don't love it. Prediction alone is not good. Triple bronze. Also tr settle for triple threes if I end up landing them. We can use the new tickets. Nothing good there. BM is not good enough. Laser beam. MBT going for the first pitch. A specialist? No. I was very close to triple threes as well. MBT, not good enough. Prediction, not good enough. 331, three, not triple threes. 313. Three. SI Charisma with exhaustion in there. That will, that'll play. That'll play just fine. We have some skill change tickets left over. Uh, yeah, we can finish them up how we want to. I'm, I'm pretty hyped for this. Uh, it's going to be a really solid set. It's going to let him hit a ton of dingers. So, yeah. No, this is great. Let's uh finish off this training. So I don't think I have a plus three power. Let me see. I have... Sort by power, we have three plus two pow plus one I. So I could do plus six plus three, right? And so that would give me plus 17. Let's see, pitcher. Yeah, Dozuna. Let's put you in the lineup real quick. Take out Piscotti. Uh, So let's see, if we add plus three I, that puts that at 113. That'd be 17, 13, 17, 15 would be fine. He does have a lot of power. I think I'm just gonna do that. I think I'm just gonna do that. Just, um, yeah, try to make up for what he lacks with, uh, cause he already has so much base power. Okay. Let's do it. Because, yeah, I don't think he needs such a tough call. And if I do that, do I want to give him a con instead? Do I want to go... No, I want to end up with more I. The reason I want to end up with more I is because his base I is lower than his base con, and he gets less of a GI toward his I. Um, so you just kind of train it to balance it out. <sighs> right, let's see. POW plus 2, I plus 1. So we're definitely going to use two of these. And it's kind of splitting hairs over uh or I could do 15 15 15 no don't want to do that I think I'll just do power I I think power I is the way to go I'm gonna commit to it plus two pow plus one eye. Let's do it. All right. Let's give him some stats.
but let's give him some special training. This takes him to level three right off the bat. Nice. Let's do some more golds. More golds. More golds. I have so many of these things. Do I have more golds? I do. Plus, we do have a bunch of packs. I'll uh, open those up next. I just wanted to clean inventory as it was right now. Got a ton of these things. Tons of silvers. Man, I'm pretty hyped for this, guys. So once he gets training up, I will do that. He'll get diamond skills. And the rest of these can just kind of toss in there. And this is before we open up two diamond packs and like 20 ultimate packs. So he is well on his way to being special trained. Oh shoot, I knew that that wouldn't work. Man, now I wish he wasn't in down condition just so I could see how he's doing, you know, what this looks like. There we go. Let's go put him in our lineups. I think I'll have him bat fourth. I'll play around once I see how he performs, but I think fourth is the way to go. Then after him, this order looks just about right. Yachty might be better in fourth. Let's see. Check out Piscotti. He's replacing himself in my lineups. Bat him fourth. This looks fine. Club lineup. Man, this is hype, guys. This is this is gonna be a good batter for me. This is my club lineup. Plus he gets batters, Kim. And my battle lineup. Right there. Bat him fourth. Alright. Well, that'll just about do it, guys. Uh, next up, let's open up packs. Alright, we made it to the end of the week. Let's go for some packs. I've been saving these for a while. Um... Yeah, 76 silvers, 82 premiums, live season premiums, position selective, team selective, gold ultimates. Listen, we're going to pull at least one prime today. I feel it. I think the odds are actually more with us pulling a prime than not. So let's go into this. Um, I'm just going to go before I, you know, throw these into special training. I'm going to go... Um, make sure that I don't have any upgrade material coming out of these, you know, like a Gallegos or something. Um, cause I'm not individually going to check each card too closely. Just want to make sure that I have, uh, just want to make sure that I have the right 
materials and I don't toss anything away that I need. So let's see, nothing, nothing interesting here. It's fine. This is just the silvers. Ah, uh, yeah, we got a vintage. That's fun. Brian Harvey. Player reserve is full. Uh, we'll keep the vintage. Where is he at? Brian Harvey, pitcher. There he is. Keep the vintage. Uh, and after I finish special training Ozuna, we're going to go and we're going to toss special training materials to finishing up Dick Hughes. Because he still has another, what, four location and four velocity. Uh, that should help him out a bit. Plus another two fastball. So, yeah. Let's go to Ozuna. Start throwing in the silver. Oh, wait. What did I just say? I said I was going to check my upgrades just to make sure I'm not being dumb and missing anything. Nothing in my league lineup. Nothing in my player reserve. You know, if I was smart, which, you know, I might, I might go back and do this. For the next set, some silvers don't increase this level too much. Maybe I go back and I open up the golds and the diamonds first. But, no, nah, we'll do this. We'll do this. He's finally not in uh, poor condition. He was, like, all week, so I didn't get to see his stats as they should look. Uh, I like that. 121, 141, 126 for the Con I pow. It'll be nice to get more Con. Could have saved that, Albert. Um... Just in case I pull a SIG one day. Don't think I would. No reason uh, not to toss him in, though. I think I have plenty of Alberts and upgrade tickets, so. And tossing Cameron Mabin. There it is. 54%. Oh, that tossed in all my gold items, too. I had a bunch of gold STXP. Wondering why I jumped up so much. Okay, so that's about halfway to level 7. Uh, yeah, and then after this, we're really close to another Sig Black Diamond. Um, you know, I have to decide between these two. Matt Carpenter is very good. He's my arcade batter, and he could use a Legend skill set. He has BM Slugger Instinct. we got to upgrade that. Molina has Slugger, barrel it up. You know, I don't... I really like those two skills together. And this would just make barrel it up even more insane if I did Yachty. So yeah, we're going to have to decide. We also have an overamp ticket. Uh, I'm leaning toward using that on Ozuna if I can get him at a high grade increase. But if not, we're going to go for Molina. Um, so, let's see. We've already got a vintage out of these. You know, I saw somebody draw a legend from these packs. I would love to get a legend, guys. I feel like... So I'm in a... I, I uh, you know, just around, like, Reddit and, and different discords I'm in. I see people pulling legends all the time. And I'm like, when is my turn? As long as I don't pull a... If I pull a suitor, I don't know if you guys have... Remember when Suter came out, I was uh, kind of pissed because he ended up being a Cub, even though he went into the Hall of Fame with a Cardinals cap. Um, so I wouldn't want to pull him. I, I would not be happy about tossing him in. I would be okay with Fergie Jenkins. He's pretty cool. Nothing wrong with Fergie. Da, da, da. Still no primes. That's okay. That's okay. I would love to land a Matt Morris prime. Um, man, I don't know how people get this many packs like weekly and still play master mode. Because I'm pretty much running master mode all the time. Like, Except for when I sleep, I have master mode running. So I don't know how people get like... Some people open up this many packs every single week. They've got to be running, like, 
overnight. Maybe use Knox and some suit, something to automatically run it. I don't know. Uh, we're also going to try to get Ozuna to full skills today. I probably won't do that on video, but if I can run enough games, um, I have enough skill training tickets that if he gets to like level three or four, we can keep. Uh, oh, I should have saved that Goldschmidt. I didn't do the upgrade thing, guys. I did exactly what I said, or I didn't do exactly what I said I would do. No players to upgrade. Okay. Well, I probably all comboed him away, huh? I also have to decide who I'm training next. Um, you know, I have 7.6 million coins. Gomber is a good one, you know, fin bonus. Right now, it's pretty commonly accepted that it's better than Dom. Also, we got a diamond, so that's nice. So that will be good for special training. Uh, so I, I trained him for fin bonus, and there's our prime. Told you guys we'd get one today. Uh, Anthony Rendon. Look at that. Yeah, so Finn bonus is, is pretty commonly accepted to be better than Dom. It's just really hard to get Finn on Gomber. I have him trained for it right now, but I could obviously uh, make it better. It's nice to get Rendon, by the way. I, that's one I didn't have. So there's our prime. I knew we were going to get one. I felt it. And another diamond. We take those. So that, let's see. We still got ultimate packs to open, too. So first, check for upgrades. Just Maggie, okay. Second, let's go lock up Rendon. Where's he at? He's a batter, sorted by grade, he was silver. Let me tell you, with the primes I have, I could make some pretty sick decks. I could make a pretty sick Nats deck with my uh, Murphy and my Rendon. With the Angels, I got Guerrero and uh, Tori Hunter that I could set up. With the Angels, I also have Trout. Like, with the Primes I have, if I was to GI him, I could make a pretty sick Angels deck. I'm not going to, but let's see. Uh, anyway, back to special training. They should get him to this, to level 7. Boom, boom, boom. Right. How and I toss these silvers into him, even though they hardly help. It's better than nothing. And hopefully, with the ultimates, we get enough diamonds and golds. Really, we just need to get enough diamonds in order to finish them up today. If not, I'll just grind out another couple seasons of master mode for. Um, the upgrade tickets or for the upgrade materials. <laughs> I'll just lo lump this guy in with the next ones. All right. Inventory to our. Well, we have team selective. We have all these premiums. Let's, let's just get through these real quick. Andrew Miller. Miller would not help my Cardinals deck out too much. Zanino. Also, by the way, we'll know by the time you guys are watching this video. But I'm recording this on the last day of the regular season. Let me tell you, I really, really want the Mariners to go to playoffs. Mariners fans, I am cheering for you. I even picked the Mariners and pick them today just so that we can, like, I, because I believe, I believe. I want to see the Mariners make it to that wild card game. So, by the time you guys are watching this, it's either going to be really happy or really sad. 
Hopefully it's happy. Let's go, Mariners. All right, there's all these live packs. Let's go for position selective. I don't even care here. Maybe RP so I can try to get a Gallegos, uh, Gallegos dupe. Nope, Montero, don't know who that is. Two basic vintage packs, would love a Tim McCarver because I'd like upgrade material. And intermediate vintage pack. Johnny Ray. Must be a newer one. Premium. Obviously, we know we want a legend out of here. Uh, Ellis Burks. I'm going to be honest. I uh, didn't know that there were Rockies vintages. You know, but I figured that they were such a... Since they're on the newer end of teams. Are there Rays vintages? Or is it... They were founded in the 2000s, right? So they don't... They don't get those old cards. So now we're going to go through... Team Selective Packs. Not going to save any for use in... Um, for use in Team Select Diamond. I'm really kind of at the point where I have most of my cards that I want. Get lots of Molina cards. There's a Pujols. Maybe we'll save him in case we pull the Sig. Because we do have a Prime ready to upgrade. So when he retires, if I don't have a Sig, that Prime's going straight in my lineup. John Nagowski, 2020. What? <laughs> I didn't even know he had a 2020 card. He had one game. <laughs> he played a couple this year. I... <laughs> wow. I'm going to save that just for, you know, kicks and giggles. Ozuna. This is the card I have. The the SIG I have. Oh, how did I lose my packs? There we are. St. Louis, let's see. Another Pujols. Maybe save that again. Okay, I don't know why I keep clicking away from these team selector packs, guys. And Tyler O'Neill 2020. You know, his card is kind of underrated uh, this year. He has been amazing for us. He has been one of our MVPs this year, Tyler O'Neill has. Nothing there that's helpful. Live season alt packs. Got a diamond. That's what we're looking for. Hey, I, Tom. We got about 15. Yeah, we'll just go. We'll go lock some stuff up and toss it away. Let's see. Let's, let's throw poo holes into the backups. You, you. To lock you up in the backups just in case and Nagowski just just because all right and let's get our Ozuna more special training I think we'll be able to finish him up here with the diamond packs and the leftover ultimate vintages we have you know, he's also a Black Diamond upgrade candidate. I could do that. Um, I just, you know... You know, I haven't grown too attached to Ozuna. I think Yachty would be cooler. So yeah, Gumby, Yachty, or Marp. The other thing I can do is save premium skill change tickets, because I don't need to hunt for any legend sets right now i could just not upgrade carpenter i could upgrade melina and then i could just save uh premium skill change tickets to try to hunt for chemistry when i eventually go for it for pitchers cam 
I'm gonna make you guys watch me do that, by the way. It's gonna happen. So. Hope you're ready for it. I'm just, right now, I'm not sure which pitcher I want to Black Diamond to do it. I'm thinking one, Nicasio might be taken out of the game this year. And so, the reason I'm not sure is because this guy has a SIG that I can dupe. This guy has a SIG I can dupe. Uh, Hicks has a SIG I can dupe. Izzy has a SIG I can dupe. Nicasio is going into the rotation or into the bullpen. And he has a SIG I can dupe. Um, and there, that leaves, I mean, one, two, one, two, three, four, five, right? There are six members of a bullpen, and I'm still looking for Al Habrowski. So if Nicasio retires and I can no longer dupe his, you know, get a SIG, then I'll make him Black Diamond and give, try to get him pitcher's chemistry. So that's my thought process there. Let's go open up these ults. Wow, not a single diamond in 10 of these? Excuse me? Excuse me? Better get at least four here to make up for that. We get one? Come on. 23 and I get one diamond? I'm sorry? Okay, and two diamonds. Oh, look, I'm getting a diamond out of them. Haha. -ha. And uh, Arietta and a Brave. All upgrade material or special upgrade material. Line up. Yeah, we should be able to finish him, even though we needed more diamonds to do it. Just want a couple more diamonds so maybe we could get Hughes a little bit more trained. Okay. Then we're just going to take out. Eh, we'll just toss him in, actually. It's going to be pretty close. How much is a single guy? 91.4 to 93.1. It's about 2-ish percent. Yeah, we're, we're going to be pretty close to max with these golds or not, so... Ow. There we go. Maxed out. Ready to go. Plus he gets pitcher's chemistry when he goes in this lineup. And I haven't finished skills yet. So yeah, he's going to be he's gonna be good. He's going to be set. Okay. Next up, Dick Hughes. And we probably have that one Steven Strasburg left. Nope, we tossed him in. Okay. So next up, let's go buy ourselves a grade increase reset ticket. Club store. GI reset ticket. Because I think Ozuna's sitting at like 67, so... You know, if he goes down, we'll just buy another one next. We can keep on, keep on, keeping on, change him. Especially because we get the 350 club coins. Um, yeah. Let me just make sure. Ozuna, 67. Yeah, see. So, yeah, we're going to reset. Hopefully it goes up. It went down. We'll try again next week. Unfortunate. Okay. Next up, skill change tickets. We got 18 of them. We're going to try to do something better than touch and mess on Lance Lynn. You know, I'm going to eventually have to use skill change tickets on another, trying to land a true middle reliever so I don't, you know, get thrown out of games as soon as I'm behind. Also, Paul DeYoung could use some. He's going to be in my lineup a while. But, you know, Lance Lynn has the stats to be better than he is. So we're just going to roll. And I have the reset tickets and points right now to retrain him if he lands Dom or Finn. He is slightly leaning toward Finn, but not much. I could go either way. So um, depending on which one I land. So let's change the skill storage. Let's go get these 
tickets and just, you know, try to land something better. The, the issue right now with Touch Mess, especially on a SIG like him, is really only Untouchable is active at a time, right? And Untouchable isn't the best standalone skill. If I could get a three skill skill set, if I could get, um, you know, multiple. Also, I'm not going to Black Diamond him soon, you know, to try to land a, a, a Black Diamond set, so. Dom, nothing. If we land three level threes, that's good. Nope. Fixer, setup man. Put away pitch. Those aren't good. Three, two, two. It's not three, three, three. Finesse, i.e., lefty specialist. That almost looked pretty. Boss, setup man, danger zone, three, three, two. Almost looked pretty. Two, one, one. PM, lefty specialist, fearless. Not good. Three, three, one. I was getting hopeful for the double. Boss put away. Two, three, three. Ugh. Man. Finesse PM. Uh, not good enough. Like even if it's better, it's not. It's not what I'm looking for. Yeah. Mess warmed up. Winning streak. Will not do it. And the last one we get Ace Stamina Fixer. Got a lot of 3 2 3s, um, but nothing we can end up using. So back to changing his skill storage. Back to what he had. And let me see if there's anything else to do today. So, you know, I have five of these things to use when I end up landing, like, a good Legend set or a good 3-3-3 set. I have a PSCT, but there's no Black Diamonds I really want to use it on. You know, that might come when I decide to start rolling for Chem. So, yeah, that's going to be it for today. See, I'm at 159 out of 160, so next week I'll make the decision on who to Black Diamond, and we'll go ahead and do that. So, yeah, thank you guys for watching. Super hyped about the new Ozuna SIG. It's going to be great in my lineup. Um, just got to get them uh, skills maxed out. And, yeah. There's one last look at him while I finish out this video. So, yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching. You know, if you like the video, be sure to drop a like below. If you have any questions or any comments, you know, put them in put them down below and I will be sure to respond. And if you consistently like what I'm putting out, you know, I try to do a video every week, if not every other week at least. If you like that and you like what I'm putting out, be sure to subscribe. So thank you all for watching and I will see you next Monday.